This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at fuel cells. A fuel cell converts the chemical potential energy stored in a fuel into electrical energy. In hydrogen fuel cells, the fuel is hydrogen and the product is pure water. In this video, we look at three types of fuel cells, a PEM fuel cell, an alkaline fuel cell and a methanol fuel cell. We'll start by looking at a PEM fuel cell which stands for proton exchange membrane. In a PEM fuel cell, hydrogen gas is oxidized at the anode, as we can see in this equation here. When the hydrogen gas is oxidized, the electrons pass through an external circuit from the anode to the cathode. The hydrogen ions pass from the anode to the cathode in the proton exchange membrane. At the cathode, we have the reduction of oxygen to produce water, as we can see in this equation here. Next we look at an alkaline fuel cell. In an alkaline fuel cell, hydrogen gas is oxidized at the anode and oxygen gas is reduced at the cathode. The product water is produced at the anode rather than the cathode. The hydroxide ions move from the cathode to the anode in the electrolyte. At the anode, they react with hydrogen gas to form water and electrons. The electrons flow through the external circuit from the anode to the cathode. And finally, we look at a methanol fuel cell. In a methanol fuel cell, the fuel is a mixture of water and methanol. At the anode, methanol is oxidized. This produces carbon dioxide, hydrogen ions and electrons. The electrons flow through the external circuit from the anode to the cathode. The hydrogen ions pass from the anode to the cathode in the proton exchange membrane. At the cathode, we have the reduction of oxygen to produce water, as we can see in this equation here. 